Wait a damn minute. <laughs> Around 7.5% of people are born with some kind of congenital heart disease, but only around 3% of them need expert intervention. That is a big gap, which you've probably figured out means that you may even possibly have a small gap somewhere in your heart, and you would never even know about it and live your life quite happily unless somebody who knows how to use one of these actually put it against your chest. Not everyone is so lucky though, as some congenital heart disease requires major and complex surgery to be able to correct, but there may be ways that we can prevent it. it includes, yes, making sure not to have children with people closely related to you like cousins, but also things like avoiding alcohol and smoking during pregnancy and getting the flu vaccine to make sure that you don't get a severe case of the flu, which can also lead to congenital heart disease. Others being obese has also been linked to it, so getting fit before getting pregnant can also only help. Not all cases of congenital heart disease are preventable. Some are linked to genetic syndromes, which are inevitable. But since some are, this is just another example of how looking after yourself also means looking after your incredibly cute future hell raises.